Well, back in Iberia Parish, a business is in its final stages of constructing a $100 million plant that will focus on utilizing sugarcane baguettes. News 10's Kai Price visited the site and gives us a look into the production. Here at Delta Biofuel, this plant represents a step forward in sustainability and renewable energy for Louisiana. Environmentally, um, we will get rid of the bag ass problem for the sugar industry. And then as we move forward, we're going to work with the sugar mills and talk about ways to make all of our operations more efficient. This facility will be the first of its kind in North America for its use of bag ass, a byproduct of sugarcane production. By using a fuel-fired industrial system, the plant will have the ability to produce over 340,000 metric tons of biomass fuel pellets every year. We will be taking uh, sugarcane bag ass, which is the, our primary feedstock from the Enterprise Sugar Mill uh, that we're adjacent to. Uh, those pellets will be trucked uh, from here to, uh, to the uh, Burnside, the Impala Terminal, for export to, uh, to the international uh, power plant market. The company is expected to create over 100 jobs with a starting salary of $62,500. There will be over 100 jobs, uh, probably 120. 130 jobs uh, between operators, uh, technicians, and logistic personnel, a lot of truck drivers. Nugent says this plan will open doors for new possibilities for collaboration and development in our economy. We leverage the oil and gas industry, the carbon black industry, and obviously the sugar industry. It's, it's some, you know, some well-needed diversification of the uh, you know, different markets in the area. Keating says they plan to power the plant in the next 30 to 45 days and will start producing pellets this fall. In Iberia Parish, Kai Price, KLFY News 10.